Hey everyone, it's Jolly. Today we'll be making blackened shrimp alfredo. We're going to season the shrimp with different spices, make a cream sauce, and put it all together. This was really delicious. So let's get started. So the spices I use to coat the shrimp are chili powder, paprika, garlic powder, cumin, oregano, and brown sugar. And of course, salt and pepper. My brown sugar was a bit lumpy, so I broke it up with my fingers. And now let's talk about blackened for a second. I usually make blackened chicken by brushing it with butter, coating it with spices, and grilling the chicken. I didn't cook the shrimp that way. I felt the shrimp would be very tough and dry if I did, so I decided to make it a little different. Go ahead and coat your shrimp with the spices, give it a toss, and of course you can always purchase your own blackened seasoning if you prefer, but why would you? Here I have a really hot skillet with some vegetable oil over high heat. I threw in my shrimp as soon as I was done seasoning them, and seafood is great to make last minute because it never needs to be marinated unlike pork and chicken where it tastes much better if you marinate it overnight. You want to cook the shrimp for about a minute on each side and the last minute I just keep stirring them until they're all pink. I could have stopped right here and made a quesadilla or a taco. These just look so good. Correction, they don't look good. They were good. So you want to remove the shrimp from the skillet and saute your green and red bell peppers in the same skillet. I wanted them to have a nice bite. I didn't want to boil them in the sauce. Therefore, I sauteed them by themselves along with some minced garlic. I cooked the garlic for about 7 seconds and then I removed the peppers and garlic and dumped them into the same bowl with the shrimp. And they're just going to hang out until we make our sauce. In the same skillet, of course, we're going to pour in our heavy cream and all of the flavoring from the shrimp is going to get infused into the sauce. It's perfect. I grated some fresh Parmesan cheese to thicken up the cream. And this is a very rich dish, but these are the type of dishes I love to cook for friends when they come over last minute on a Monday night unannounced. My mom said that only happens when you're in your 20s. We'll see. I let the sauce simmer over medium low heat for about 10 minutes or until it was nice and thickened. I placed all of the shrimp and veggies into the sauce, gave it a stir, and now it's when the sauce is going to develop a beautiful color that just screams, I'm so flavorful, eat me. Season this with salt and pepper to your liking. I use penne pasta. If you would like to use fettuccine, you can slice the peppers in long strips. If not, you can dice them just like I did. Give everything a stir, add some extra Parmesan cheese if you'd like. Taste for seasoning, it's never too late to check for seasoning. Make sure it tastes perfect. I sprinkled some parsley and that was it. Serve this with some salad, bread, wine. Invite some friends over, watch some stand-up comedy. All right, I'll stop trying to convince you, just make this. It was so delicious, I promise. I hope you guys really give this recipe a try. Hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you have all of the ingredients to make this recipe. And thank you guys so much for watching.